Hi, I'm going to explain now Curly's function. In NVL function, if you see, it takes on the two arguments. So if first expression is null, it returns second expression. But in Curly's, you can give as many as you want. If first expression is null, it checks the next expression. If next expression is null, and it checks the third expression, it returns the third. So it goes on like that. So, so how to use this function? So if we take this example, select last name, comma employee ID, call is to car underscore commission percentage, to underscore car manager ID, no commission, no manager. If if this expression is null. It returns this one. If this is also null, it returns this one. That is how it's happening. See, let me show you. For king, commission percentage is null, and also king is not having any managers. Is no, is a vice president of company, so no managers. So what is it? Is no commission and no manager. Okay, let me run this query. So right. last name, comma. Employee ID For that, I want to show you select last name, comma employee underscore ID from employees. Let me run this query. So, so a king is not having manager ID and also commission percentage let me add commission so no commission package percentage and also manager ID so when you run this one so it will show as no commission, no manager to king. Okay. So our next le lesson is case and decode functions.